Hey, welcome back to Destroy All Humans 2 Reprobed. So this will be the beginning of part 6 for our playthrough. Um, we still have some side missions to do in Albion before we move on to the third map. Uh, we might only have one more. I'm not sure. But uh, if we get done with those in a short matter, we'll move back on to the main story missions in the third map. So let's get into it. Well, is it Thursday already? Who are you people? Someone called us stone posers, I guess is what we are. <laughs> you got a leader? Look for the walking man. He's so vertical it hurts. Mitch! Did I miss the Hendrix gig? You're smashed up worse than Pete Townsend's Rickenbacker. What's, uh, what's the deal? Revelade, oh, Revelade. I need it. You're stoned on Revelade? You have Revelade? Gimme. Oh, ah. Uh. Hey, guys, uh, I got something that'll chase your blues away. Whoa, the colors, man, the colors. Daddy? You guys stink. The color of revolution is not brown. Revelade makes unhappy tummies, man. Oh. Don't blame us. I can help you shake this monkey off your back, monkeys. With what, man? We've tried everything. Easy. I'll infuse you with the spiritual essence of Ark Voodle. Even triple to still won't work, man. Nothing helps. Brothers and sisters, I feel your pain. Oh, my brain's melting. Ah. So, everybody's gonna worship Arkvoodle? None opposed? All in a day's work. Silence is an ascent, man. It is in this case. Uh, call it a benevolent dictatorship if you want to. You'll be wrong, but if it makes you feel better, knock yourself out. I bet I could tell you I'm an alien from the planet Furon, here to harvest your brain stems, and you wouldn't even care. Cool! Do it! At least that'll take care of my headache! You know you're signing up for a cult, right? Uh, don't you want to see my true alien form first? Whatever floats your boat, man. Whee! I don't even know why I'm bothering. Behold. <laughs> you're like a little green toddler. Say that again and I'll break your jaw. Now hustle. You got worshiping to do. Maybe tomorrow. Could you maybe give us a lift home, yeah? I, I can't seem to move. Cheers. Great. Just great. I better get something out of all this. That's all I'm saying. He 
Is it the old Bill? Oh, bad Bill. Ah. Ah, someone bring the doctor. If you think I appreciate having my time wasted in this manner, you are very much mistaken. Hey, what am I doing out here? Come on, buddy. We gotta get you home. That was so groovy, thanks. Master. I have people to see. Yeah, what's that? Ah, Cliff Richard! Follow the army! Come hey, on. So Bring Dr. Cornermass! Follow me. Oh, so yes. a space leprechaun! What? Thanks, stranger. Is that something? Mm. Boys! Oh! Who's that there? Oh, for goodness sake! Why don't you just stick mirrors on your shoes like all the other wankers? Ooh. I'm like I say, who's there? Hello? Oh, Blimey, oh sir. this is all labor's fault! What's oh, no. up? <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, fancy Out bit. with it! What's going on? Oi! Is it the old bill? Mm. Hello? Yes. As they come out and present yourself. Invaders from beyond. From beyond. Where's the bleeding TARDIS? Elok Voodle, Lord of the Sacred Crutch. It is good to be somewhere different for a change. So tell me, Shammy, how things been? All quiet on the Eastern Front? Not quite. We seem to have a government mall amidst our midst. Nobody ever told me cults were so high maintenance, although it is kind of flattering. Nonetheless, we are in need of your talent for disposing of inconvenient obstacles discreetly. Discreetly? Ah. Oh. It's Super Weapon O'Clock. What do you got for me? We have finally discovered the key to the weapon. Alien DNA. What do you think I'm made of? Musk sticks? Not Furon DNA. Something else. Something very, very aggressive. 
we will need very many alien artifacts to make it work. Another gather the berries quest. You want me to slay a dragon while I'm at it? Okay, keep your panties on. I'll find your mole and take care of him discreetly. You may have to go undercover to rat him out, but do not upset the hippies. Their nerves are a bit raw. Revelade with brawl, it's a bitch. Now I got a tiptoe, too. This mission just keeps getting better and better. could like tell these cultists to shower or something. Hello? I'm trying to be aroused here. This Arc Voodle cult sure has a galvanizing effect on its members. Perhaps we can use Arc Voodle to regain the colonies. It might be a bit too late for India, though. Oh no. They realize I'm not the pill-popping degenerate I claim to be. Help! Oh, no, not again! Bleeding, And I was pulling off the irascible rascal act so well. Can somebody say yes. something? Oh, no. I'll help you. Someone's playing silly buttons. Better things to do. Statistically speaking, it's All still right, the same way attention. to travel. I'm never fl ah. What? I'm up for anything, me. Come on. I just want to lead you to your doom. We're gonna drown you. If you're going to drink, call a taxi. I accidentally threw him and I wasn't supposed to do that. And somehow it still counted. Must have landed in the water. Salutations! Shammy, we gotta stop this radio show. We can't have people freaking out about aliens. My life's already inconvenient enough. You think looking this good just happens by itself? Why do you think I'm on the show if not to save your figurative bacon? Please, relax. There's got to be something I can do about the UFO crazies who are going to call the station. You know, something explosive. All you need to do is disrupt them. These people always use public phones. But the DJ will announce their location at the beginning of each call. They should be easy to find. Then I get to make with the Annihilation. Got it. 
Violence is not the only path, my son. You need only disrupt them. Their deaths are not necessary. Yeah, yeah, I heard you the first time. Listen, you do your thing and I'll do mine, capiche? All right, time to listen in, find the crazies, and take them down. Make sure to get the calls off the air before they betray any conclusive evidence. It will not be hard for me to discredit them once they have disappeared. Make them disappear. Welcome back. You've tuned into our newest program. Alien Overlords, myth or reality? We want to hear from you, our listeners. But What's first, let me introduce a man of some note, Mr. Guru Shamalama, leader of the relatively recent Ark Voodoo phenomenon. Tell us, Mr. Guru, why should we worship this Ark Voodoo? Because Ark Voodoo is Lord of the Sacred Crunch. His benevolent love knows no boundaries. Please go on. He or a Skeptark Voodoo as his personal lord and sexual savior can achieve unprecedented sexual prowess and prosperity in all matters of the groin. His recent conquests include the planet of the Huris, where he seduced a race of white brazens from space. Yes, and time for our first caller, Jeff from Soho Bridge. Hello, Jeff. What's the bus? Do you have a testimony on our Google to share with us today? You mean spacecraft? No, Welcome back. You've tuned into our newest program, yes, yes. Alien Overlords, Myth or Reality. We want to hear from you, our listeners. But first, let me introduce a man of some note, Mr. Guru Shamalama, leader of the relatively recent Ark Voodoo phenomenon. Tell us, Mr. Guru, why should we worship this Ark Voodoo? Because Ark Voodoo is Lord of the Sacred Crutch. Sephardic Voodoo, as a personal lord and sexual savior, can achieve unprecedented sexual prowess and prosperity in all matters of the groin. His recent conquests include the planet of the Huris, where he seduced a race of white raisins from space. Fascinating. And time for our first caller, Jeff from Soho Bridge. Hello, Jeff. Yes, What's yes, the what bus? Do you have a testament about all Google to share with us today? Mmm, pick a red grave, any red grave. You mean space craft? No, it's a big space craft. Make out of any craft. Welcome back. You've tuned into our newest program, Alien Overlords, Myth or Reality. We want to hear from you, our listeners. But first, let me introduce a man of some note, Mr. Guru Shamalama, leader of the relatively recent Ark Voodoo phenomenon. Tell us, Mr. Guru, why should we worship this Ark Voodoo? Because Ark Voodoo is Lord of the Sacred Trust. His benevolent love knows no boundaries. 
Please go on. He who accepts our Buddha as his personal lord and sexual savior can achieve unprecedented sexual prowess and prosperity in all matters of the groin. His recent conquests include the planet of the Huris, where he seduced a race of white raisins from space. And some brothers too. Jeff from Sunrise Bridge. Ah, Jeff, what's the bus? Do you have a testament about all you want to share with us tonight? Thank God I got that apple off. Am I just being dumb? How are you supposed to find them? Yeah. Out of all the places you can check. And then I'm being shot, so. Welcome back. You've tuned into our newest program. Yeah, I don't... Overlords, myth or reality. We want to hear from you, our listeners. But first, let me introduce oh a man gosh. of some note, Mr. Guru Shamalama. Leader of the relatively recent Ark Voodle phenomenon. Tell us, Mr. Guru, why should we worship this Ark Voodle? Because Ark Voodle is Lord of the Sacred Rock. No pun. He who accepts Ark Voodle as his personal lord and sexual savior can achieve unprecedented sexual prowess and prosperity in all matters of the groin. His recent conquests include the planet of the Huris, where he seduced a race of white raisins from space. Fascinating. And time for our first caller, Jeff from Soho Bridge. Hello, Jeff. What's the bus? Do you have a testament about our poodle to share with us today? Oh, it's a by it. Space Thank you for Spacecraft. You mean spacecraft? Welcome back. You've tuned into our newest program, Alien Overlords, Myth or Reality. We want to hear from you, our listeners. But first, let me introduce a man of some note, Mr. Guru Shamalama, leader of the relatively recent Ark Voodle phenomenon. Tell us, Mr. Guru, why should we worship this Ark Voodle? Because Ark Voodle is Lord of the Sacred Crutch. His benevolent love knows no boundaries. Please go on. He who accepts Ark Voodle as his personal lord and sexual savior can achieve unprecedented sexual prowess and prosperity in all matters of the groin. His recent conquests include the planet of the Huris, where he seduced a race of white raisins from space. Fascinating. And time for our first caller, Jeff from Soho Bridge. Hello, Jeff. What's the bus? Do you have a testament about Ark Voodle to share with us today? Oh, it's abducted by it. You mean spacecraft? No, it's a big floating raft. Maybe I'm going to get the raft here. Oh, it's a Hello? Hello? Jeff seems to have been cut off. No, no, it's all. I bet you might have heard this Jeff before. He caused some trouble to our fooder some weeks back when he escaped from a local mental institution. Perhaps the wardens managed to pry him away from the rec room phone. Fascinating. Astounding. Stay tuned for more alien overlords, fact or fiction. Our next caller is Robert from Parliament House. Tell me, Robert, you're not a loony, are you? Uh, no, I'm a public servant, actually. Much of a muchness these days, eh? But what's your reason for calling? Astral projection? Visitation? 
Cynthia, and for God's sake, please be safe. while we head on down to the park and check out the veracity of her plays. What's all this that's happening? It's a... Oh my god, what is that? Are you bloody mad? I need the chase queen.
terrestrial business. They cannot see him. Wow, these beings are. Yes. What saved me? You know Alien! They're coming. I was trying to get them to chase me so I could outrun it for the achievement, but uh, clearly they did not work. Seems to me we need some new Slade devotees. <laughs> Any ideas? We could paper the streets with promotional flyers. The only problem is that the local art scene is kind of dull. We need something truly groovy. Yeah, I can see how that's a problem here. I know, the freak, he could do it. The Freak? What are you getting me into here? I knew you to go to Bay City and find The Freak. His groovy art skills are just what we are needing. All right, Bay City, coming up. But where do I find him? He usually hangs out in Hushbury, across from Golden Gate Park. Voodle speed, son of Voodle! Man, you don't know my pain. 
Shama Lama tells me you got some groovy art skills. Want a gig? No way, man. I'm bombed. I'm no good for anybody right now. Okay, I'll bite. What's wrong? And what do I gotta do to get my posters? You wouldn't want them anyway, man. Everybody hates my work. Is this a, a private pity party, or can anyone join? You don't understand me, man. No one does. I'm tortured. Right. Your situation is utterly unique in human history. Look, aren't your paintings all over Hashbury? If people hated them, they'd paint over them or pee on them or something. Ha! You want to know what people think of my art? Fine, I'll show you. I totally painted that, man. Well, except the urine stain. Just ignore that. See? Oh, God. He's not... Let's get out of here. Aw, oh, man, that's so depressing. I can't you don't have to be a just about it. Whoa. Hey, yeah! They're really Whoa. getting into this. Damn, oh, we got a move on. All right! Oh. Oh. Groovy! Start a love! Oh, Adrian, follow me, man! on those posters and no one's even reading them. Oh, this is heavy. Everyone hates my work. I'm never going outside again. Oh, no way. I'm not hanging around to be blue. I'm a dancing machine. Yeah, man. Wow. I can feel everybody's grooving. Must be my art. Whoa. I'm beginning to oh, wish wow. I'd painted more than one picture. Where's the variety? What? Have you seen this mural? You dig it? People just don't appreciate art these days, you know? Whoa. Hey. Whatever, man. There are other forms of expression. Uh -oh. <laughs> ah. Oh, thank God. Run for your lives. Everybody you run. Like a nice Hawaiian oh. punch. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Groove on, baby. That's my heart. You Whoa. see, don't it feel good? People Whoa. seem to really connect with my art, you know? Brother from another planet. Sure. I'm totally getting into the art scene, man. Pretty soon everybody's gonna know my name. See? Lots of people love your art. You're living the dream, baby. It's freaking inspiring. Oh, man. Who knew people could get so into art? This is incredible. I've never felt so legitimate, so loved, so totally accept- Moment's over. Move on. Now knock off the self-pity and paint me a damn poster. That's a tall order at the moment, man. It's tough for me to put my hands on art supplies. Oh, yeah? <laughs> Why am I not surprised? Nudie mags, confiscation, you know. But the voodoo will come through for me, right? You can find this stuff for me. Show them they can't repress art, man. What do you say? Yippee. People should love my work. I'm a golden god. Somebody 
there? I didn't know. Goddamn flashbacks. Oi, Holly! Stop it, Tarski! Drop it! Good. Yes, yes, what is it? Yeah. What's all this then? Shh. Run for your life and you What? Yeah, what's that? Hmm. How's that hanging little dude? Oh, I'm sick of thought. Don't answer that. 
Well, I finally got the freak to cancel the pity party. Tell me you got the posters. I did, and they look groovy. <laughs> Let us get to distributing. Any more info on my part of this super weapon thingy? The DNA looks terrifying. It is some kind of beast with gigantic fangs and gnawing and biting and daring. Whoa, whoa, calm down, Sparky. I get the picture. I'm not sure how you got that from the DNA, but okay. We found something bizarre in Takoshima, too. It is on its way. I will know more later. Time to become the opiate of the masses. Just dump the flyers along the streets from your saucer. The groovy artwork will do the rest. And people are gonna read something dumped on them from a UFO. Any publicity is good publicity. And the culties have been hyping it up. They think it is just a stunt. But status quo, right? The cops will still try to shoot me down. Oh, I'm afraid so. And they are even less tolerant than the base city policemen. Let me guess. I can't fire back. Again. Nope. Be careful up there, son of our boodle. Will you show yourself? Well, I haven't got all day. Gonna be blown up. Dude, 
you know I love you. Did you see our way? I believe in Aunt Voodoo, so tell me that I'm saved. The shields didn't really seem to do anything. Like I'm supposed to suck up specific enemies for the bonus objectives while I'm being shot at. I can't chop back. Ah yes, let's start back at this part. I say So jealous, man. Artwork, man. This arc woodle is really far out. Whoa! It like floated into my hand. That's mine. That is. I want to be safe. The horrible savages littering my streets. Good heavens, it's a ticket tape parade. Horrible savages littering my streets.
There we go. Doesn't look like we have more side missions, so I guess we can move on. I know Team Vader from the space. I have a pen and a pencil set. What are you gonna do with pen and a pencil? Return green for in devil! I am the light! Thou shalt have no other light before me! Which means that lighthouse has to go. easy. Hey, doll face. Where does an alien go to have some fun around here? Krito, Takoshima is a melting pot of ancient and modern human cultures. It has a rich history and a vibrant, popular culture. Okay, save me the history lesson. How do I get into this melting pot? You'll need to get to know the people who live here first. The villagers, the urbanites, the police, the ninjas. Wait a minute. Ninjas? They got ninjas in 1969? Eh, go with it. Who doesn't love ninjas? And believe it or not, we are not the only foreigners here. This place is crawling with KGB. They get around, don't they? You always invite me to the nicest places, and then you never let me destroy them. Krito, we're on foreign ground. We have to be careful. Careful, Schmerful. I've been a model of self-restraint, but there's only so much I can take. Sooner or later, nature's gonna take its course, and when it does, well, don't say I didn't warn ya. <laughs> oh, Crypto, you're so impulsive, like a little boy. Little? Ah, uh, Missy, case you hadn't noticed, I'm packing a howitzer over here. No, no, it's a good thing. I haven't laughed in a long time. There's not a lot to laugh about in my country. Oh. Okay, I guess. You still think I'm sexy, right? I think you're one of a kind. <laughs> right on. <laughs> so what's the scoop? What'd you drag me down here for? A reliable source has told me that there are KGB agents waiting for a package exchange somewhere in Takushima City. I need you to go down there, intercept the package, and bring it back to me. Easy as tort, da? Sounds like a good idea. In theory. In theory? 
Well, I'm not here in a lot of room for Boom Boom in this plan. Perceptive as always. If you screw up the package exchange, you will be blown to smithers. Smithereens. No, thank you. I just ate. Ay, ay, ay. Intercept the package, huh? Okay, how do I do that? Nothing you can't handle. You'll need to disguise yourself as a KGB agent, and talk to the courier when he arrives. He'll probably be a bit on edge. If you approach him as creep, though, he'll most likely destroy the package. Some people have no appreciation for beauty. You know, I'm starting to feel a little taken for granted here. Yeah, I'm not just your little messenger boy. Crypto, is that what you think? I don't see you that way at all. Look, if you do this for me, I promise I'll make it worth your while. Like Venus Butterfly worth my while? More like I let you blow something up worth your while. Mmm, okay. But I get to use nukes. <laughs> I mean, nukes are the fun way. I'm gonna smack you up! Vince Brown, so cool! He got photo of soul! Um, I said, God damn it, my ass ninja! Now this is for a different trophy. I supposed to get up there.
Hmm. I mean, I don't think you get like a jetpack boost or anything later in the game. I don't believe so. I mean, I'm almost like right there. I just need a little bit more of a boost. There's just nothing I, you know, like stand on. Oh well, I guess we'll come back to it a different time. Thought I could get it done now, but I guess not. You look Who the I want who's there? Um It seems like it's over this way, but then it's not. Spot appears on the map, but then it's like maybe. Oh, 
Ultra Boy on. What the hell? What's that? How you get up there? Never let me I see go back them. to office. I number one office fan. make me feel so safe. Yeah. Space Ninja! Oh. KGB agent, what I mean. with me to see me alone. It's just, I don't know, it's kind of crazy. You can't even step a foot on ground without being, like, swarmed by 50 cops. Like, how am I supposed to fight a specific agent if I can't even go on the ground? Disguises don't even seem to work. It's like, you jump and people are suspicious. Like, I don't know. Dude, I think I got it from the rendezvous point before I can even take over a KGB agent.
I know. I go to where they, they want me to go, but it's not activating. I don't I don't get it. I mean, what specific spot do they want me to stand in? I feel like I've gone down every street, every alley, building. Like, it's not telling me. It's telling me. Okay, look. Go to market. Nothing. I mean, what, where do you want me to go? On a building? Not on a building? In an alley? Not in an alley? It's like wants to be right there, but I don't know why. Cause it's not it's not active. Yeah. Like I feel stupid because I feel like it should be working and I'm doing something wrong, but I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Yeah, I know this is a cop, but I mean, that doesn't look like KGB. I mean, I don't know. What? Oh. Not a fighting child. I was about to say, who saw me?
Excuse me. Thank you, sir. May I have another? I, I'm done. I'm done. I, I don't, I don't know. It's probably not even this alley. I'm too annoyed. To care, I've been going too long. I'm just done. We'll figure out in the next stream. I, I I don't know, and I don't I don't care enough to try to figure it out right now. Yeah, I feel stupid. I've spent like 25 minutes trying to figure out where to go for one mission. I mean that's a third of the stream. So you know, um. Sorry about that. I know it's boring, but uh, I guess I'll catch up with you guys and see you in the next one. Maybe then we'll figure out where we got to go. But until then, bye.